currently I'm gonna go to the airport and then we'll be heading to Thailand. Just made it in. Um, this is not much people, maybe because it's like February and who flies in February? Except for those who graduated, I'm just kidding, but uh, yeah, so excited. We're going to Bangkok first and then my mom's friend will pick us up from Bangkok airport. And then we will be heading to Pattaya by her car, which will take about an hour. And I'm not fond of riding long distance in the car, but it is what it is. And hopefully I don't get nauseous or motion sickness. But yeah, look at my eye bags, guys. But um, I'm super excited. Hopefully I can vlog all my activities in Thailand, but public vlogging is just not my thing, especially with my mom's friend around, so. I had a dream last night, it was different It was you and I and faded television I'm not in love with you, love with you But if I was, here's what I'd do We just arrived at the airport If I was in love with you Torn up sheets, all the feathers There's a picket fence somewhere, nothing better just arrived in our hotel and honestly it's so quiet right now so I can only whisper I don't know why this is like the most quiet this hotel I've ever been to Hey guys, oh my gosh, so I'm currently in my room now and apparently I didn't notice but my mom's friend actually booked two rooms and my mom wanted to stay with her together in the same room so I have this room to myself which is great because it makes it easier to vlog and give you guys a proper update without feeling embarrassed but currently I'm living in SN Hotel if I'm not mistaken and I'm super excited uh, I got this room and it's not bad, it's like a 3 star hotel the interior downstairs in the lobby is actually really pretty but then when you come up here the corridor the walkway actually has some sort of like smell that i don't like but it's okay first i landed in bangkok and then it was around like 1 p.m ish the line the immigration line was so long because there were so many tourists afterwards my mom's friend picked us up and then she drove us to pattaya and this hotel which took about one hour and 30 minutes and now we are here so i'm gonna give you guys a little room tour so this is the door and when you come in it looks like this and we have a mirror over here they have some water and everything some snacks but you have to pay for these but the water is free and the fridge and then here is the toilet i'm just doing this really quickly yeah the toilet there's nothing much actually nothing much nothing special we have two beds yay really excited we also have this little balcony area which i think is super cute so this is my outfit of today i'm really bloated right now because i'm not feeling well like my i have a lot of stomach issues but um yeah i'm wearing this green cardigan this white top and then this skirt yay very happy currently i'm just lying down now and it's almost like o'clock it's about 3 26 p.m i guess and i am really tired right now i think i'm just gonna rest up a bit and i'm just gonna see where my mom and her friend will take me after this i think they're all just unpacking and settling down for a little bit okay so we're just gonna check out the fitness center and the pool and then we're heading to the beach that's what my mom friend just told me and i'm gonna put on my shoes now and then we'll be heading out <laughs> Just arrived at Tutu Beach, I think. Life is boring, so I'll never leave 
sunset, you guys. We just ordered some drinks and just admiring the sunset before going out for like official dinner. But it's so pretty, it's so relaxing on the first day. But here's the best though. So the sun has officially set that and we are leaving now. We're gonna go find a restaurant and eat there. That was really pleasant. To be honest, the beach was actually a little bit dirty, which was a letdown because there was like litter. But it is what it is because it's Southeast Asia. So yeah, it's very common here in Southeast Asia. It's not just Thailand, to be honest. But if they maintain the cleanliness, I think this is a very nice place. And now we're gonna head for dinner. hotel now yeah i'm just gonna rest up for tonight we had half a day in pattaya today and surprisingly i feel like it was quite productive even though our day kind of started at like 4 p.m it's been amazing so far and i'm really happy i had like tummy issues and stuff but thankfully nothing bad happened today so i'm just gonna rest up for today and then i'll see you guys tomorrow day two outfit super cute dress that i bought from malaysia brand outlet I'm just getting ready to go out now i just had like hotel breakfast it was okay so i didn't really feel much since it wasn't that special I'm gonna get my bag ready and then i'll be heading out So we just arrived at this place, it's called Nush Tropical Garden area So apparently this is like one of Pattaya's attractions Just came here and I'm waiting for my mom's friend Then we're gonna buy tickets and then head in There's these fake dinosaurs Look at all these cactuses, it's so pretty I don't know why but my phone is overheating but right now we just climb up some stairs and there's these like dinosaurs and pretty plants as well there's a lot of random dinosaurs and there was also an elephant show but i don't know if i like it or not i don't know whether they're getting taken good care of i just left and i'm trying to enjoy the plants it's pretty i love the lighting too I don't know why my phone is overheating. It's so creepy. The eyes look so realistic. It's actually giving me the creeps. Wow. Eh, what? There's a random gorilla. Got some watermelon juice because it's really hot. I'm really thirsty and hungry, so. You should be more worried. It'll never begin. So, I'm 
by the beach just to like take some photos of the city view and stuff and there's like the iconic Pattaya sign it's really pretty here I like it just gonna take some photos and then we might go up the mountain the water is so turquoise like my camera can't even capture how beautiful it is right now Hello! <laughs> Ooh, it's a temple here, I think. I didn't know that. So cool. There's so many Buddha statues, so. Oh my god, there's a cat! He's sleeping. Each one represents like the day, so it's like if you're born on Saturday, you can, you know, give some donations for this Buddha. Statue. I was born on Tuesday, so I'm the sleeping Buddha, kind of. Here to rest, I suggest at this place because it looked really, really pretty. I had a dream last night, it was different. It was you and I and faded television. I'm not in love with you, love with you. But if I was, here's what I'd do. Here's what I'd do. If I was in love with you. Torn up sheets, all the feathers There's a picket fence somewhere, nothing better A dose of Chanel perfume And coffee in the afternoon You way ahead of the side Flip it in the mirror until you get it right My pillow's in the shape of you I'm kind of afraid to move Will you ever know what I went through? Will you wake up in my bed in the afternoon? Every time I'm so full, so right now I'm just I'm trying to digest from dinner. And it's sunset hour, it's so pretty. And I hope that they still remember it too. Subliminal love, 432. I had a dream last night, it was different. It was you and I and faded television. I'm not in love with you, love with you. But if I was, here's what I'd do. Here's what I'd do. 